Oh, what's up adventurers? It just started to rain a little bit, but according to the weather forecast, it's going to pour down any minute now. So I thought I would uh, do some testing to see how well my hammock equipment fares in uh, rainy weather. Better to get some experience with it now, instead of uh, having a disaster in the middle of an overnighter. So join me on today's adventure, guys. And let's have some fun. Oh yeah. I packed my tarp on the top of the bag. So it's the first thing I can grab at location. So I can quickly uh, make a roof over my head. Okay, the rain is officially starting off again. Gotta be quick. It's pretty cozy, I have to say. Let me show you what can happen in the rainy weather when you're sleeping in a hammock. The water can drip down here on this line, under the tarp, over here and down into the hammock, making a pool. So hopefully, if you tie a little knots here, the water can uh, run down here and it will simply fall down due to gravity or it will try to run over this uh, little metal uh, hardware thing and it will just drip down from here. That's the logic at least. Pretty cozy, man. Everything seems to be dry so far, but this adventure has just started, so time will tell if everything is dry at the end of this. I know that uh, I can uh, go on uh, adventures, even though the weather is a little bit sketchy. Up until now, uh, there's been plenty of times where I've planned out adventures with you guys, but I had to uh, ditch last second because uh, the weather forecast uh, decided to give bad news. And I don't want to uh, get caught in uh, bad weather in the middle of the night, getting myself and all of my equipment drenched. Right now, I'm gonna cook up some food. Then we're gonna take a little trip around the hammock, check out the straps and all that stuff, see uh, how far the, uh, the rain has come. And if everything is, uh, is dry, then it's a pretty successful mission and uh, we can be, uh, be a safer on uh, the up, up and coming adventures. But if uh, things are wetter than we hope to, we at least know that something has to be improved. <sighs> Yeah, I'm just gonna lay here, relax for two minutes, and then uh, gonna cook some food. Heck yeah. The rain has started to pick up. I think it's in about the third gear, something like that. I'm starting to get hungry, so um, this it's the meal for today. It's the only thing I brought with me today, so it better be good. I'm gonna use my uh, old and trusted uh, Tokes uh, titanium cup as my container and my Jetboil uh, Mighty Mo grill system. You've seen it before and you see it again. I don't really know where I'm I'm gonna put my stuff because everywhere under the tarp it's pretty bumpy. I don't know if I should put a stick under one of the legs to prop it up so I can have it under the tarp but then I will have to be cautious not to knock 
the sticks away. <laughs> okay, check it out. The sticks uh, lifting up this leg right here to make it even. I just moved you over here. Get a get another angle here. I'm sure you're pretty uh, but tired to look at the side of my face. So you can see this one. I can try to not knock off the sticks right here. That went uh, way quicker than I thought. So let's uh, pour the water in the bag here, up to the fill line. Actually, we can take a little uh, walk around the hammock right now to see how things are going. I'm not gonna bore you and force you to uh, watch me packing down my stuff, so I'm gonna be back with you soon when I'm ready to do some uh, inspection around the hammock. So stay tuned. I packed down all my uh, cooking stuff, so now we'll just have to wait for uh, our food to get uh, ready. And in the meantime, let's uh, check on, the, on my little shelter here. The straps. They're a little bit moist up here. Completely dry so far. Let's see on the other side. Up here. Pretty moist. Just gonna dry off my hand. Nothing. I can't feel any moisture down here at all. So, so far, it seems like a big, uh, big success. But, uh, the rain was uh, bad only a little, uh, a little while. We're back under our uh, roof, safe and sound. I'm gonna put you over here, then we're gonna eat. This little bugger just landed on my arm, on my shirt. It's pretty gross. Now it's on my freaking leg. I totally forgot uh, where I was because uh, this freaking thing messing with me. <coughs> I'm not gonna give you the gory details, but I can tell you that it won't bother me anymore. It's time to uh, eat. Mm, tastes good, man. Pretty good. Thumbs up. So it's time to uh, do a little inspection round. It's been uh, raining like this, kind of slow but very steady the whole time. And I uh, came up with, uh, with an idea. If everything is dry, I can try to uh, pour the remaining of uh, this water onto my suspension line to see if that can manage to run all the way down to the hammock. First, let's uh, take a look right now to see if this system has managed to keep us dry with this weather right now. Okay, I can uh, definitely feel it's, uh, it's wet. Let's see under here. No, nothing. Bone dry, not even a little bit moist. But we gotta check the other side. Nope, it feels a little bit cold, but that's it. We can see all the rain has been gathered uh, on the tarp. Okay, to find a little test. Kind of difficult to do this with uh, one hand on the bottle and one hand on the camera. Oh, I can see some water here. It was dripping down right here. It was a very fast flowing stream. 
Yeah, this is pretty wet right now. The water managed to only get uh, get down to the to the hardware here, but everything else is bone dry. So now I'm uh, pretty confident that I can bring with me this setup, uh, even though it's uh, raining a little bit. I'm pretty freaking happy with that, so I don't have to stress about uh, the weather having to be all sunshine and stuff. And, uh, it's a cozy little setup. So thank you guys so much for joining me on today's adventure and thank you so much for clicking the like and subscribe buttons it really makes my day honestly and i'll catch you guys next time heck yeah